Hi everyone, Charles here with you on the Friday afternoon. Well, I think this is like the third time I've done this uh, audio recording here and I uh, get off on talking about other things. But what I want to talk about right now is a, a, um, a, a post by the Associated Press that's just been, been put up uh, an hour ago. Here's, what, here's the beginning of what it says. Fewer than a third of U.S. Catholics rate the honesty and ethical standards of clergy as very high or high. The latest evidence of the hierarchy's diminished credibility as a result of the clergy sex abuse scandal, according to a Gallup poll released Friday. So the link's in the description box, and that's really... I mean, I, I, I have enough on my mind and in my heart right now to uh, talk for a, ra a rather long time, and I'm not going to do that. Uh, for at least the time being, I feel like I'm being called to, okay, here's a story that's in, in, in important. And uh, this story is important because it shows our prayers and our sufferings and uh, our fasting are working um, to alert other Catholics, at least in the United States, that, um, you know, um, uh, you know, th that there's, um, that we're getting through to them, that Jesus is, is being able to, we're giving Jesus what he needs. What he needs from us is our love, more love. We got to love more, and the way we do that is to love Jesus more, and love, 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 and, um, to, you know, we will conquer all this. Jesus can conquer all this with our love, because he's written us into salvation history. Oh, God, God bless you, and uh, we'll talk to you again soon. Bye.